Say it's your old school Lamborghini here, mate. Horses are well trained. Yep. Yeah. Pretty, pretty much. Yeah. yeah. How many times do you do this in a day, then? Uh, morning, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I just count after. Yeah, one, I bet you do. <laughs> the horses know where they're going today, or? <laughs> yeah, they, they just keep going. Yeah. Well done. Give him a drink. Yeah. So you're getting pretty good weather up here at the moment? Yeah. yeah. It, it rained on us on Friday, but uh, yeah. Yeah. but uh, it was it's been pretty good weather for the yeah. last two weeks. Yeah, we get up there. San Francisco on Friday and it hammered down, it was really wet. Wow, you came in on Friday? We was in San Francisco on Friday. Yeah. Then we it stayed. Pretty wet then. It was, it was awful. <laughs> Saturday was okay. Yeah, but you should be used to it though, huh? Yeah, in England, yeah. Uh, we had a pretty wet and cold winter this year. Yeah, you've had a cold winter there? Too? Yeah, look, quite a lot of snow. More than usual anyway. Oh, I'll be darned. Probably the most snow we had for probably, in our town, for probably about 30, 30 years, 35 years. Yeah. Really? Yeah. You know, they're molly crazy. Yeah. <coughs> well, we're from a place called uh, Hereford. Oh, okay. It's all in the west of England. Yeah. Where, uh, where the Hereford cattle came Exa from. Exactly, yeah. mate, yeah. We're famous for our cattle. Yeah. Famous for our uh, uh, cider. Drink, cider, yeah. apple oh, yeah. cider. Famous for that. And home of the, uh, I don't know if you've heard of the army group called SAS. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, their base is in our town as well, like, yeah. anyway. So, oh. but, yeah, it's pretty rural, a bit like this in a way. Is it really? Yeah, it's probably about. The city's probably about 60,000 people. Oh, I'll be done now. You know. So, it's still a, is it still a pretty good uh, farming area there? Yeah, still, you know. We'd say very sort of, they've uh, got cattle, arable, sheep, uh -huh. you know, apple orchards, that type of thing. Oh, I'll be done. A bit of wheat and stuff as well. Oh, okay. yeah. And we've got quite a big, a. Uh, uh, for the big industry, so you got the cider. Well, the firm's taken over now by Heine. They could have taken over the local. Oh, is the cider? Is it a hard cider? Or is it a? Is it just like apple cider? No, it's a hard. You know, it's oh, like it liquor cider. Yeah, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Because you know, got one big one like Bulmers, probably the biggest cider. It was taken over a few years ago by Heineken. Yeah. They took it over, like sort of thing. Oh. It was, it was like the biggest cider producer in the world, I think. Like so. Huh. I thought Heineken was made in Germany. Yeah, well, Heineken's a Dutch company, like, anyway. Oh, it is? So, oh, yeah. Okay. But they, they own lots of different alcoholic companies, like, anyway. Oh, okay. But I've, I've seen a couple of supermarkets around here, they, the, uh, the Bulmer's name, sort of Strongbow, I suppose. Yeah. You might have seen, seen a couple of American supermarkets over here, like, oh, anyway. Okay. So. What, what's the cider called? Uh, Strongbow's is, like, a brand name that you see abroad here, like, anyway. Strongbow? Strongbow, like a bow. Oh, strongbow. Bow. Yeah. Bow, strongbow. Oh, oh, strongbow. Yeah. Get up there. Mm. So what do you do over there? I sort of, uh, I sort of repair sort of televisions, really. Oh. Do air, fit satellite dishes, aerials. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that'll keep you busy then. Yeah. Self-employed, or you? Work no, what is it? Well, it's just two of us. We're in small company, just two of oh, us. Are okay. I like it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> what up, you old now? <laughs> gold, Shimmett? Gold, Mr. We ain't carrying no gold. No gold. Just passengers. Very poor down? passengers. This is all I got uh, today. A few silver coin in my poke, Mr. Uh, how about you people out there, guys? Silver and gold out there, people? No gold at all, no. Okay, how about Mike's got all the gold. Do your kid bring me a cane from the store? Any candy cane, though? No, no, no all, all, all eaten, mate. Okay, next time, bring our candy. 
Hey, you, Mitch, are you going greenback in those pants pockets? No, no greenbacks. Okay, I'll get you next time. You guess next time, dude. All right. <laughs> hey, you back here, guys. So we're going back there, people. <coughs> yeah, we do. All right. You want to share? No. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take some of yours. No. <laughs> Don't work that way. <laughs> hey, how about you, Mitch, guy? We see your cigars? No, oh, no. All right. <laughs> Just luggage today. Uh, chin out. <laughs> Just the gloves. Yeah. Right, how about you ladies? Hold up the sound. Let me see the shiny ring now. Don't be shy. Okay. Good Lord, I don't want it. Are you all there, ladies? Great. All right. Are you sure you keep an eye on anything else? Molly, Gracie, get up there. <laughs> there you go. So how long are you over here for? Uh, well, we've been here for about nine, ten days, and so we're heading back, back to LA next Saturday to fly home. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we started off in LA, we went down to San Diego for about three days. We popped up back to LA to do theme parks and Disney oh, yeah. and Universal Studios. Then say so we're up to San Francisco, now we're heading inland now. Here today, down to Yosemite Valley tomorrow. Oh, nice. We moved to, uh, we're meant to be heading off down to Sequoia National Park then and Thursday, Friday. But I say, look, they're talking about snow at the moment, down that way. Yeah, that's what they're saying. Yeah, I don't know. It, you have much snow this way or? Um, you know, we're just Below. low enough we don't get yeah, much no. snow. When we do, all it does is cause traffic problems. Yeah. Do you get the roads cleared pretty well? Yeah. They, yeah. Uh, you get the plows out and that? Okay. Yeah, they got plows out, but yeah. They, uh, yeah. they don't do the best of job. No, no. no. How do they do back there when it snows and that? They got plows that keep it clear? <laughs> Not yeah. very well. I say it doesn't happen very often, to be honest with you. Yeah. We have got plows, but yeah. they probably keep some of the main roads open, some of the smaller roads get closed. Yeah. That's the problem here when it does snow yeah. back. Yeah. I only know this because I worked for the road department oh, for 30 yeah. <laughs> years. <laughs> yeah. I, my, my last job was a road supervisor. Oh, well done, yeah. So all of this area yeah. was, was, my, was my area. Yeah. I had... Uh, Oh, I had uh, the, the biggest district in this county. Yeah. And uh, the 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 when it snowed to this elevation, yeah, the lane miles doubled. Yeah. So you were instead of going up country taking care of the snow, you were dropping back down. Yeah. Trying to get all of that. Yeah. Nowadays they don't even bother with no. that. They just head straight up country. Yeah. Yeah, and then let this melt off. You yeah. Know? The only problem with it here when it snows here. It stays cold, yeah. And so you have a lot of icing issues. Yeah, we did that. Yeah, and, and so yeah. you know you you need to get it off of these roads so you don't have to worry about them down here. Yeah, we had a lot of ice. The problem was the the plows come through and all the pavements, all the sidewalks get covered in snow and freeze yeah. up. Like yeah. anyway, like because yeah. it was very small town, I can walk to work in half an hour, or the kids can walk to school in five minutes. Right, but so, so dangerous it is. It's like an ice rink. Just you know, just uh, 20 minutes up the road, yeah. and sometimes it'll pile up. You'll have berms seven, yeah. eight feet tall. Yeah, like snow drifts. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, we did this. Say the last lot we had till back in sort of January time. Well, no, it was March, wasn't it? Yeah. We went out for r running it, and it was up to our, up to our knees. Oh, really? Then drifting and up to probably my my height sort of thing. Yeah, I'll be done. Where the wind whipped it up. It so says rarity, you know, you can go years and years and have no snow. And say this year we've got about three lots of it. I'll be they called it the beast from the east. They said it's oh, a, 
Oh really? It was called like anyway because it was like the weather coming in across from Siberia Russia way they were saying so. Oh, okay. and here we go, back to base. Yeah. No, this last storm came from the came out of Hawaii. Yeah, it was called so, Pineapple Express, wasn't Pineapple it? Express, yeah. yeah, it was yeah. this one with local news.